Hi, this is Mike from Microsoft Box and Reviews and How To, and on today's video, we'll be taking a look at the A320 chipset and the Ryzen 5600G. Does it actually work or not? Keep watching to find out. Okay, so in today's video, we'll be taking a look at the A320 chipset and its compatibility or lack of with the Ryzen 5600G. Now, a couple of you have asked this question, so I figured I'll do a quick update video and see if it actually works. It does seem to be actually quite a popular question, and I actually wasn't sure myself. The A320 chipset is very limited now, it's been out for a number of years. There are regular BIOS updates to it to allow more features, but as it stands at the moment, to get it out of the way quickly, no. As it stands, as of today, which is the 1st of March 2022, the 5600G does not work with the A320 chipset. Now this is pretty much across the board. I have looked at various other models. The one we're using today is the MSI A320M-A Pro. Uh, the Pro, the Max version, etc, etc. I have had a look through the various BIOS updates which are available. I was actually thinking that it might work. There was a update for the Renoir processor range. So this will actually support now the 4000 series processors, the OEM ones such as the 4300GE or the 4300G, those kinds of things. So if you're looking at that sort of processor, you will be absolutely fine with a BOSS update. Obviously, you will need a compatible processor, first of all, to update your BOSS to the latest version. Uh, some of that you'll be seeing on the screen now. But sadly, as it stands, this is currently running with the 5600G and it isn't displaying anything at all. So yeah, this is just an update. For those of you asking the question, does the 5600G work with A320 chipset? Currently, as it stands, beginning of March 2022, the answer is definitely no. But if you are interested in how this progresses and if it does actually work in future, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and we will be trying to do updates on this if there's any new bosses or any new updates which actually allow this to work as it should do, then we will be making content on that just so that you're all aware of it. But just to reiterate, as it stands at the moment, the 5000 series, although supported, so if you're using a 5600X or a regular desktop CPU, you will be absolutely fine with the 5000 series, but currently the 5600G and the 5700G, which are the two main retail processors, do not work at all on this particular platform. So hopefully this video has been useful to you. If it has, don't forget to give a thumbs up. Uh, if you've got any comments or questions, you know where to put them in the comment section below. But for now, I've been Mike. This is Mike's Unboxing Reviews and How To, and hopefully we'll catch you when there's a BIOS update. Thanks for watching.